Hi everyone, um, back again. This time it's to answer some of your questions. We've had a lot of people both in store and online wanting to know the difference between Rio's existing fly lines and their new in-touch fly lines. So don't worry as far as the tapers go, they've stayed exactly the same. So Rio's award-winning fly lines like the Gold and the Grand and the LT stayed the same as far as the tapers go. The difference is old fly lines have the stretch core and the new in-touches have their connect core, which is a non-stretch. So this only stretches up to about 6%, whereas the old, more traditional fly line cores will stretch anything from 28 to 30%. Which if you take a look at just this normal piece of fly line here, this is just an existing Rio Gold. And if I just give that a stretch, you can see the difference there, and that's only over a small distance. So if you magnify that 30, 40, 50, 60 feet, that's quite a lot of stretch in there. Whereas the new connect core is going to eliminate the vast majority of that. Now as far as your casting goes, you're going to get a lot more feedback and tension when you're casting. Um, your bite detection when you're fishing is going to be better because that's in immediate contact with that fish. As well as that, your setting and your striking of the fish is going to be slightly better, especially at long range. Now they've done this through their floating line ranges as well as their very popular deep series, which is the 3, the 5, the 6 and the 7. Um, along with that, they've managed to keep the uh, welded loops at the front and on a few of the fly lines as well, they've got a welded loop on the back so it's nice and easy to connect it. Um, as well as that, you've got the markers for the hanging on the sinking lines, so when you're retrieving in a boat, you know exactly where you are when that marker clips through the top ring, and that'll allow you to hang those flies nice and easily. Um, all in all, a great uh, uh, improvement on the old lines. We're getting great feedback from the customers that they're catching more fish on these fly lines. They are a little bit more expensive to produce as far as the cores go, so there's a slight premium on the other lines, um, but they are beautiful lines and well worth it. Um, we hope that this is going to give you a little bit of an insight into what's the pros and cons between the existing fly lines and the new in-touch ones. Um, any problems at all, don't hesitate to give our stores a call or go online to www.sportfish.co.uk. You can follow us on Twitter as well as Facebook for all our latest news. Um, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and every time we release a new video you'll get notified straight away. Um, we look forward to seeing you the next time. Tight lines and good fishing.